Hey, it's Lana. Welcome back to Solo Trip Podcast. And if you're new here, hi. I'm an independent music artist. I write, record, and produce my own music. And I also film four videos a week here on my YouTube. And this series is all about spirituality and metaphysics and the occult and so, so much more. So for this video, we're going to talk about feeling lost. Because, as I said in a previous video, I kind of spiralled a little bit recently and started feeling quite low. And it sparked another, like... I always say the phrase revelation, I feel like I need a new word, but it sparked some kind of realisation within myself about when you feel lost, sometimes we resist the fact that we're even feeling lost and we want to just solve it and fix it and like get out of it kind of thing. And oftentimes, especially in my own journey, the like doing that prevents you from even figuring anything out because you're resisting where you're currently at and when we're in a state of resistance we're not able to move forward so for me I've really come to realize that actually it's okay to feel lost and it's okay to embrace the fact that this is where I am and that this really means that I need to make a change in my life because the only reason I would even feel lost in the first place is because I'm not sure on my direction, I'm not sure on where I want to go. So it's really about actually surrendering to the fact that you're feeling this way and that it's okay to feel this way and to embrace feeling this way and then allowing yourself to come and be fully present in the moment with that feeling so that you can uncover where it is that you want to go but you can't uncover that when you're basically punishing yourself for not knowing where to go you know we don't have to have every single thing figured out in one go because isn't that the whole point of this life is that we're supposed to experience it we're supposed to uncover something that's unknown we then like use that thing that we've just uncovered to move forward a little bit then we uncover some more and we use that and we move forward a little bit and then we uncover some more and like the whole journey is constantly stepping into the unknown constantly gaining insight and clarity on something that we didn't know before or that we couldn't see before even if our hearts know it but like consciously we couldn't see it or hear it or understand what it was you know so like we don't need to have it all figured out we don't need to have a whole life mapped out we don't need to have our whole like goals and plans and everything completely decided down to the t because that just cages you in and blocks out all of these infinite possibilities and opportunities that could come to you if you weren't caging your mind into this one idea and this one way for something to work so when you're feeling lost it's actually okay to just admit that that's how you're feeling and to let yourself just feel that and be there in that because the answers to where it is that you want to go will come to you when it's time and when you're ready. But I feel like actually feeling lost is almost a blessing because our emotions are not to punish us. It's there to be like your guidance and your road sign. Like your emotion is literally your road sign. So that means that you're not lost because you now have a road sign telling you, hey, we actually need to go this way. (laughs) I don't know why I just did that weird little voice for a fucking emotion. So your emotion is actually speaking to you as a road sign telling you, we're doing this thing and it's making us feel this way. So now that we're feeling this way, we need to go in this other direction because that's what the change is kind of directing us towards you know if you're feeling sad doing one thing you know that you don't want to do that thing anymore so now you've had you've now got your road sign saying we don't want to do this thing anymore let's do something else so then you can move on to something else and that's not lost because you're changing direction and you're doing something else so how is that being lost it's actually not being lost and that was just a revelation that just came to me right now (laughs) So yeah, I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for listening and watching. I really appreciate you. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already and check out the description box for links to -to one-to-one sessions with me if you'd like to work with me, as well as my phone number, my music, my jewellery brand and everything else about me is all in the description box below and I will see you in the next video. Bye.